What is up guys? This is CK and I'm gonna walk through one of the OG crypto wallets out there. This is the Ledger Nano S. This is in fact my very first wallet. Um, the Nano S is uh, not the newest wallet by the Ledger at this point, but it is a fantastic go-to and it comes at a really fantastic price. In this video, I'm going to unbox the Ledger Nano S, set it up on Ledger Live, and then show you how to use it without with minimizing the amount of privacy that you leak using Wasabi Wallet instead of Ledger Live in order to uh, transact and actually use the hardware wallet. Ledger with Wasabi or Electrum or any other um, wallet that you can connect to your own node is a fantastic wallet. Um, it has a lot of other altcoin support, but it also supports Bitcoin and you can use it as a Bitcoin only wallet. Uh, so again, uh, really recommend the Ledger Nano S as a piece of your uh, Bitcoin security infrastructure. I am a general fan and user. So let's jump right in what comes with the Ledger Nano S. All right, so here's the Ledger Nano S box. One thing I think is sad about the Ledger Nano S packaging is that they don't really have good um, anti-tamper uh, uh, security. Uh, you know, you just saw it was just packaged normally in like a box like any other um, hardware wallet. So you can open it immediately. Uh, they do say that their secure element inside uh, would prevent anyone from being able to uh, mess with the signing. So they don't have to have a tamper resistant box. Uh, but I do think that uh, that is a little bit baloney. Uh, I got this directly from the manufacturer. I highly recommend ordering it directly from Ledger. Dot com. Uh, don't get it from Amazon, don't get it from any of those things in order to minimize the attack surface. But the form factor kind of looks like an old school USB stick. I think that's why a lot of people like it because it was a very familiar form factor, uh, especially early on in the uh, crypto days, especially uh, 2016, 2017. This is probably the most popular wallet in the entire world right now in terms of the amount out there and amount used. Um, and so yeah, that's, that's the wallet. Let's see what else what comes in the packaging. So you get a uh, instruction guide and a sticker packet. So let's open this up. Here are your instructions, your uh, recovery seed uh, phrases, all that good standard stuff. USB. Uh, you get a little, little lanyard and that's about it. That's all that comes with it. So. It is really, uh, you know, comes with all the essentials um, as well as obviously the hardware wallet. Trusted has a lot of Lindy. Uh, secure element, again, uh, one of the OGs. So um, highly recommend Ledger. Next, let's jump to Ledger Live, show you how to download the Bitcoin app, and then from there, how to use it with Wasabi. Now that we have the Ledger unboxed, we're gonna set it up on Ledger Live and install the Bitcoin app. And then from there, we are gonna go and export it over to Wasabi Wallet. Uh, so what this is going to do is this is going to allow you to use the Ledger without ever referencing, uh, without referencing Ledger Live or sending any information to Ledger's node. And the beautiful thing about Wasabi is that you can connect it to your own node very easily um, and use Bitcoin on your Ledger Nano S trustlessly. Uh, the Wasabi software is available for free online. It is open source software. You can verify that the maintainers and developers are the ones who are giving you this code. You can look through this code if you want to. Uh, highly recommend Wasabi but Ledger does enforce that you use Ledger Live over here on the right so that you can in initially install the Bitcoin app onto this onto your Ledger Nano S. So uh, I'm gonna log into Ledger. Okay, so once I plug in my Ledger Nano S into my computer, I need to first set up a pin on the device. Again, this is a fresh device. Okay. Now I have to confirm my pin. 
All right, now the device is going to give me my 24 recovery words. So I have to write these down. So this is gonna take a second. Okay, now I have to verify that these are in fact my words. This is gonna take a while, guys. Oh boy, that took a while. I have finally confirmed all 24 words that they are safely written down here. Again, it is extremely important that you confirm these words and that you keep them in a safe place. If you have any significant funds in here in this ledger device or any hardware wallet, the seed phrase is your only backup if you are using a single seed situation. So now I need to connect it again and sync it with ledger live and get the bitcoin app so plugging in my pin now this is a little bit of a redundant process but okay so now that the ledger is being recognized by ledger live i am going to allow ledger manager and now it's going to give me the option to install the different apps that they support I only care about one. Let's install the Bitcoin app. All right, cool. And so you do not want to press on this. If you do this, then you give your information over to this wallet and makes it so that Ledger has a copy of your XBUB. You do not want to do that, um, but I will update the Ledger from here. So yes, I have the recovery seed. The reason why you do not want to give Ledger your XPUB is because you are not using your own node with Ledger Live. Ledger Live does not currently support that, although they say that they will support it and enable you to use your own node. But as long as you cannot use your own node, it is better not to dox the XPUB because if they have your XPUB, if they have the skeleton of all the addresses that this seed can derive, then what that does is it makes it so that someone who has that information can see all of your transactions using that wallet into the future and into the past. That's extremely sensitive and private information. So that's why we are going to use Wasabi Wallet, which allows us to use Ledger and sign with Ledger and gives us a bunch of other cool Bitcoin only features. Um, and it allows us to use our own full node and not trust Ledger's node or docs that information to Ledger. Okay, we're good to go. Ledger is completely up to date. We have the Bitcoin app installed. We have not created an account in Ledger. I'm gonna close out Ledger completely and let's full screen Wasabi Wallet. Okay, so what we wanna do now is click on search for hardware wallet. So we're gonna search for the hardware wallet. Boom, it found the Ledger Nano S. Now, I'm gonna double click on this guy and hit load wallet. You can see at the top right that it's loading the XPUB information and it will soon have a full wallet set up here. All right guys, now you can see that the Ledger Nano S has been completely loaded. Um, you can see that with this, you have the ability to send and receive as well as view your history. So. The best thing about Wasabi Wallet is that it follows best practices in terms of coin control as well as coin labeling. This helps you control the UTXOs that are in your Ledger Nano S. If you use Ledger Live, it just gives you one balance. You have no ability to choose which UTXO you're gonna spend from or in order to label it so you know, you know, is this UTXO connected to my identity? Is this UTXO uh, more anonymous? Did I get this UTXO from this person versus this person? So Wasabi actually enforces it. Like you can't, you can't not write something here. So uh, I'm gonna say test receive. Right, so generate an address, boom. Here is a fully labeled address. It's fully SegWit enabled, test receive. Um, once I send to this, it will disappear and it will not allow me to send to this address again. So uh, really like a lot of the features around labeling and coin control inside of Wasabi. Um, I'm not gonna send to this address, um, but you get the idea if you want to send, you go here, it's gonna give you less of your UTXOs. Um, and then of course you can send, sign with your ledger, 
and go from there. So again, you guys highly recommend check out Wasabi Wallet, check out uh, the Ledger Nano S. It is an OG tried and true wallet. Uh, so again, uh, some really good and very affordable Bitcoin and sovereignty security devices and software between Wasabi and Ledger Nano S. Uh, thanks for watching. If you like this content, make sure to like, subscribe, share, and review all that good stuff. We love the comments. Um, we love it when you show us on Twitter. Uh, make sure to follow at Bitcoin Magazine and I am CK Snarks. You can follow me at CK underscore Snarks. Peace.